eight, launch auto sequence seven, has started. Six, five, four, three, two, one. Go for launch. Separation confirmed. Stage one is transonic. Landing lakes have deployed. And Falcon 9 has landed. Good evening. My name is Kate Tice, and I'm the Quality Systems Engineering Manager here at SpaceX. Thanks for tuning in as we attempt our 180th overall SpaceX launch, set to lift off with 54 Starlink satellites from Florida's Space Launch Complex 40, which you see there on your screen. If you've been following along with our launch schedule, you'll know lightning and poor weather forced us to stand down from three other launch attempts this week. The weather officer once again held a briefing around T minus 40 minutes and indicated that we're currently at a 60% chance of violating launch criteria tonight, However, that is an improvement over the 90% chance of violation we were given yesterday. All of that being said, uh, we are currently no go on weather, but we do plan to run the clock down to T minus 30 seconds to see if those conditions can clear up in time. The teams are currently tracking no issues with Falcon 9 or the spacecraft, and the range is green for launch, and we are proceeding with a T0 of 9.15 p.m. Eastern time. With liftoff in just four minutes from now, we are standing by for TE Top right, retraction. Lower started. And there we just heard the call out that that TE retraction is beginning now. Those clamp arms at the base of the fairing have already opened. Falcon 9 is underway with propellant load, which began at T minus 35 minutes. RP-1, or our rocket-grade kerosene, is complete already on both the first and second stage. Box loading is still underway on both stages. First stage will wrap up in just about 20 seconds from now, and second stage will wrap up its LOX load around T minus 2 minutes. Stage on Pogo. Stage one lock load complete. And there we just heard the call out that lock load is complete on first stage. So the first stage is now fully loaded with RP-1 and locks, and we are awaiting completion of lock load on the second stage, which will wrap up in about 30 seconds. So there we just heard the launch director reiterating that weather conditions are still currently no-go, but we intend to run the clock down in an attempt to Stage two locks load complete. in an attempt to once again thread the needle. And there we just heard the call out that locks load is complete on stage two. So at this point in time, Falcon 9 is now fully loaded with one million pounds of fuel and liquid oxygen. Hold, hold, hold.
Launch abort auto is ready. This will be a script for tonight's launch attempt. It's going to set up for a uh, 24 hour recycle. Next attempt, Saturday evening. And there we just heard on the nets that we are standing down yet again from today's launch attempt due to bad weather conditions. The vehicle and payload remain in good health and our next launch opportunity is Saturday, September 17th at 8.43 p.m. Eastern Time. As always, thank you for tuning in and we hope to see everyone back again here tomorrow for our next attempt. Have a good night.